Control Valve Definition Types and Applications A control valve is a mechanical device used to regulate the flow of a fluid, whether it's liquid, gas or steam, by varying the size of the flow passage. It's an essential component in industrial automation and process control, used in various industries such as oil and gas, power plants, pharmaceuticals, water treatment and food processing. Control valves receive signals from a controller like a PLC or DCS and adjust the flow rate accordingly to maintain desired process conditions, such as pressure, temperature, level or flow rate. Control valves can be classified based on different parameters such as their operation mechanism, flow characteristics and actuation method. Control valves can be actuated using different mechanisms. Manual control valves are well operated by hand using a hand wheel, lever or gear mechanism. They are typically used in systems where automated control is not required. Pneumatic control valves are operated using compressed air. They offer a fast response and are commonly used in industrial applications. Examples include diaphragm actuators and piston actuators. Electric control valves use an electric motor such as a servo motor or a stepper motor for operation. They are ideal for remote and automated control. Examples include motorized ball valves and electric globe valves. Hydraulic control valves use pressurized hydraulic fluid to control valve movement. They're, you know, suitable for high force applications. Uh, an example of this would be a hydraulic solenoid valve. Different types of control valves are used based on flow characteristics and specific application needs. Linear motion control. Valves move a closure element, such as a plug, disc or diaphragm, in a straight line to control the flow. First we have the globe valve. It provides precise throttling control and is commonly used in steam, oil and gas and chemical plants. Next is the gate valve. This valve is used for full, open or full, close applications and is not suitable for throttling. It's ideal for high pressure applications in water supply, oil and gas. Then there's the diaphragm valve. It has a flexible diaphragm that moves up and down to control flow. This type is perfect for handling corrosive fluids and slurries, making it ideal for pharmaceutical and chemical industries. Finally, we have the pinch valve. It uses a flexible tube that is pinched closed to control flow. This valve is used for handling slurries, chemicals, and in food processing. Rotary motion control valves. These valves use a rotating mechanism, like a disc or ball, to regulate fluid flow. First, we have the ball valve. It uses a spherical ball with a hole to control flow. This type of valve offers quick on and off control, making it ideal for gas pipelines, water systems, and HVAC applications. Next, there's the butterfly valve. This one has a circular disc that rotates to control flow. You'll often find these in water treatment facilities, power plants and HVAC systems. Lastly, we have the plug valve. It uses a tapered or cylindrical plug with a hole to control flow. This type of valve is suitable for high pressure and corrosive applications. Control valves are selected based on flow characteristics. First, we have the linear flow valve. Here, the flow rate changes proportionally with the valve position. Then, there's the equal percentage flow valve. With this type, small valve opening changes result in significant flow change. And finally, the quick opening valve. This one provides maximum flow with minimum movement. Control valves are used in a wide range of industries and applications. In the oil and gas industry, control valves play a crucial role. They regulate pressure and flow in pipelines, control crude oil and gas processing, and manage steam and fuel flow in refineries. In power plants, control valves are essential for steam flow control in boilers and turbines. They also regulate cooling water flow in power generation and manage fuel flow control in combustion systems. In water treatment plants, control valves are indispensable. They regulate the flow of chemicals for purification, control water distribution in municipal supplies and manage wastewater treatment processes. 
chemical and pharmaceutical industry, precise dosing of chemicals in reactors, handling corrosive and hazardous fluids safely, regulating temperature and pressure in processes. Food and beverage industry, controlling ingredient flow in automated processing, managing steam and water flow in sterilization, ensuring hygienic fluid control in dairy and brewing. Step-by-step -step working of a control valve. One, signal received. The control valve receives a control signal from a controller, like a PLC or DCS. Two, actuator movement. The actuator moves the valve plug or disc to regulate flow. 3. Flow adjustment. Based on the signal, the valve opens or closes to maintain the desired pressure, flow or temperature. 4. Feedback mechanism. Sensors provide real-time feedback to the controller. 5. Process optimization. The controller continuously adjusts the valve to maintain stable process conditions. Control valves are vital in process control systems, ensuring precise regulation of fluid flow. The selection of the right control valve depends on the application, fluid type, pressure, temperature and control requirements. Whether in oil refineries, power plants or water treatment facilities, control valves play a crucial role in maintaining efficiency and safety in industrial operations.